Good morning guys. So I'm in a different location to when you last saw my videos. I am back in London. I arrived here yesterday. We ended up kind of cutting the road trip short. I really hope you can hear me through this mess but obviously I've got to wear it in here. But yeah, we ended up cutting our road trip short. We needed to come back and get lots of work done. But I've come today to see Dr. Nina at Cosmetica, hence why I'm just sat here now with my mask on. Um, I'm actually getting my fillers done, hopefully. And she's just gonna kind of have a consultation with me, see my face and suggest from there. But I like to have my treatments very natural. I've kind of spoke about this before on my channel, probably in like later videos. So I thought I'd kind of take you along and show you what I get I'm done. I'm just here with Dr. Nina. She's in all her glam gear. Hi. <laughs> um, so I'm going to have a little bit of filler in my lips just to kind of plump them out and also kind of slim down my jaw here because that's something I always kind of like pick on, up on myself. It would just look nice, I think, to just kind of enhance this and slim it down. So. Well, I've just finished up at Dr. Nina's. As you can see, my lips are a little bit swollen and red at the minute. Hopefully you can see and this light keeps going in and out. But they're just a little bit feeling tender. Obviously, I've just had it done like 10 minutes ago. So I'll let them settle today. Obviously, I'm just going to wear no makeup and keep putting lip balm on them. But I only had a 0.5 mil, so a very, very slight enhancement just to kind of keep them a little bit more plump but like I said I don't really like to go overboard with it and she always kind of like makes sure to go around my cupid's bow here at the top because I like to keep the shape sorry I was just seeing the traffic there but yeah like I was saying sorry um she kind of goes around the cupid bow and puts it mainly on the sides of my lip to just kind of level it all out and make it look even but yeah I'm really happy with it and I'll show you kind of later today or tomorrow with how they're looking i'm just going to keep the moisturizer loads of lip balm today so i ended up stumbling in zara of course and i'm loving all of these pastels how pretty so i've just got back and obviously as i was in zara i stumbled in zara home I seriously have homeware issues, I can't stop buying stuff. So I got these little straw placemats, these are £4.99 each and I just thought these would look nice or even if you want to put them in the middle of the table and serve stuff on them. And then I also got these cushion covers which were in the sale. I'll put it this way so you can see. I love the frilly edge in this kind of like taupe colour. And these again were in the sale for £7.99. And I got them to put on the cushions out there if you can kind of see. I got them from H&M but I'm just not keen on them so much prefer this and it also matches the new throw we got. We actually got this from Spain out of the Zara home sale there. It was I think 25 euro from 90 and I just went in Zara home now obviously and it's still full price here for 90 so really happy about that. So yeah I got these two cushions them and I also got these cute little kind of glass bowls which I thought would be really cute to serve some like ice cream and puddings in and I have been craving ice cream and jelly so I'm going to make that tonight and these were only 3 99 so these pieces were such little bargains so I'm going to put these on the new cushions and just get on with the house I need to tidy the house unpack and just do all them kind of errands today Chris doesn't seem to think that the new cushions should go on here I quite like them I was going to put them outside I mean these have right, gone all squished now spot. <laughs> yeah, but if you lie across, obviously you can move the cushions. <laughs> You're such yeah, an idiot. Really you can obviously move the cushions. This would be a good like head pillow. Look. There you go. Oh, that's a good position for the sofa for watching the TV, no? I've already got to remove 12 pillows before I go to bed. Now I've got to remove pillows before I sit on the sofa. Well, it looks pretty. Huh? Do I, do I look pretty? You look very pretty. I think we just test it out. And if you go in the corner there, you can put the pillows around you and make a little nook. Yeah, but I can't go there because you take that spot and then I've got to like... Well, you always lie me anyway. Or do you think we should put them outside then? Here we're outside. All right, you take that right there. <laughs> what do you think? Or out here? Yeah? With the black ones? Yeah. 
So I've had lots of new things come in whilst I was away. So I thought I'd do a bit of an unboxing on here and show you what I've got. So in here is of course my favorite Charlotte Tilbury. This is her new airbrush flawless setting spray. So her airbrush um, foundation is the one I wear every day. You guys, if you've subscribed here and you watch my videos, you know I always wear it. So this is the new setting spray, which I'm really excited to try. Obviously I've got no makeup on at the minute because I've just had my fillers done and I'm having a makeup free day. I've also got my hair mask in by the way, my Moroccan oil one. I slept in it last night and it's just dry. So that's why my hair's just kind of scraped back. So I've got this in this size and then I've also got it in a mini size to sort of put in my bag when I go out and about. And this is part of your night, stay all day. So it literally will last all day. And I always trust her products. You guys know I go on about them all the time. They are legit my favorite. So I'm very excited to try that. Actually, I kind of want to smell it. Is that weird? Mmm, it's got such a nice smell to it. It's like a rose kind of smell. So fresh. I'm just going to spray it on me anyway because that feels really refreshing. Okay, so that's that. Then I got some goodies from Bare Minerals. I always use the Bare, Min Bare Minerals makeup brushes. So they sent me some new ones, which I actually need to clean my other ones today. That is on my list to do. So I've got some of the brushes to go along with the Endless Summer Bronzer. So let's have a look at this. And there's also a highlighter, I think, in this package as well. So... This is the bronzer. Looks very dark on this camera actually, you can't really see it. And maybe put it up closer. It's definitely not that dark in real life, it's kind of like a light bronze. So this is the warmth shade, so I'm excited to try that out as well. And then we've also got the highlighter, and this is in shade 3 I think it's called, let's have a look. Oh wow! Look at that. Again, I don't feel like the camera's doing it much justice, but that looks insane. And yeah, this is the shade free. Let's do a little swatch if you can kind of see here on my hand. That looks so lush. So I've got some makeup goodies. I'm going to clean my makeup brushes today. That is a must. And then I've got this picnic basket that I've been sent and it actually smells really nice. I feel like they've put like a scent in here or something. So this is from Wilkinson Sort for their little new shaver. Girls, we all need a shaver in our life. And I always love the ones that have the little sort of face around them. So it's obviously got the cream, so it helps when you're shaving. So this is the new one, it's the Intuition. So obviously I'll be trying to get this out. And it says also for tricky areas, so we'll try that. And then in here, they've sent a lovely little summer package. Summer's not cancelled, so get your pit pins picnic ready with Wilkinson Sword Intuition Complete Razor. So getting us ready for summer, even though I feel like my summer started since our trip. We've got a little rosé to go. How cute, the mirror blue one. And oh my god, I've not used one of these in years, like a proper um, camera, like a disposable one. So I want to take some pics on this, so I feel like it will turn out really cute. So I might do that this weekend, because that's really sweet. And I think this is what's making it smell really nice it's got like a again like a floral scent to it that makes the whole basket smell nice and then also in here is some um batten balls which is cute we actually wanted one. Oh, here's bailey who's found the ball you can't steal this one no should we say hi back from your holidays yes did you have a nice holiday yes <laughs> So I've got a cute little batten ball and then there's also some like chocolate goodies in here as well. But I just thought what a lovely little treat to send. So we've got a new picnic basket as our last one actually did break. And then in here I've got some treats from Elemis. So I feel like actually all of these are pretty much my favourite brands like Charlotte Tilbury, Bare Minerals, Elemis. And they have sent me some top ups of my favourite products. So this is the Plumping Pillow Facial. I've run out of this, so they've kindly topped me up. I use this every night, it's insane. Really good night cream. We've got the Overnight Radiance Peel. I've started using this for the past month and I find it really helps with my pigmentation in my skin. I don't have, <laughs> maybe it's just gone off with my makeup brush. But as I was saying, I don't really have bad pigmentation. Um, I just feel like 
sorry I don't really have bad skin I just ha feel like I get pigmentation especially from the sun so obviously I've just come back off holiday and I feel like I've got all my freckles that have come out and uh, my skin just needs to calm down a bit from being out in the sun and exposed so yeah that overnight peel really helps with that this is the rose mist spray this is my favorite for summer and i also took this away skiing because it's so refreshing it's basically like a hydrating sorry it is a hydrating serum but it just sprays on like a mist and it smells amazing because of the rose scent to it oh my god i miss this so much because i ran out i basically used it all from skiing and also the start of summer so I highly recommend if you're wanting something in your handbag to just kind of like refresh you, it smells amazing and it leaves your skin really moisturised. Really good kind of product if you work um, a 9 to 5 just to kind of have at your desk as well to refresh you. Then as I've been on holiday they also sent the Tan Accelerator, this is a natural tan booster. So you're meant to actually use this pre-holiday and it's going to help but obviously now I've come back I'm going to still continue to use it and see how that works. And then we've also got some of my face washes, which I love. And this one's my favourite face wash. This is the Chia Calm Cleansing Foam. So obviously it comes out as a foam and it's just my favourite. So it's got the Micellar Cleanser in there as well. So all my favourite products, they've completely spoilt me. But generally I'm obsessed with Elemis skincare. I started using it over a year ago and will never look back because it really does do the job. So there's some goodies that I've got. Oh, and also... I got these new prints so if you guys don't follow her already she's called Tula Rose I'll put her Instagram here and also down below and she does these amazing designs and she has kindly sent me these two from her new prints that she's done oh sorry there's another one behind here as well three so these ones are very similar these are kind of like a fruit kind of abstract vibe that's going on and I love these colors it very much is in theme with my house absolutely love them she's just amazing she's so talented and then also this one of the girl in a bikini the outline of it and again this abstract feel which i absolutely love i have these prints a lot around my house so these are just beautiful so if you're looking for some artwork or just print designs or anything like that go check her out and she also has amazing instagram a style as well so she is such a babe for sending me these. I'm going to get some nice frames and put them up in the house somewhere. I'm thinking maybe along this wall and do like the three of them. Because I absolutely love the colours of these. So yeah, I feel very lucky. I've come home to all these amazing gifts. So I thought I'd share them with you because I never really do unbox on here. And again, like I said, I'll only kind of talk about the brands that I really love. And these are generally my favourite ones. But I need to get on with the rest of my day. I've got to go and unpack, clean the house, and do them errands you have to do like after a holiday. So I'm gonna crack on. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight. Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy but things are finally right With you and I the future is bright oh, You and I we got it Wednesday had to think about that I'm losing track of the days it's because we got back on Monday I'm a bit like off 
off my schedule this week but I've basically just been this morning really busy with shooting campaigns catching up on work so I'm just picking up the camera again now so sorry if this vlog is a little bit um in and out but obviously I wanted to talk to you properly about what I had done with Dr Nina so this is my lips today obviously I have lipstick on I have makeup on today now my ear I don't know if you guys follow me over on Instagram if you missed my stories if you did I got a really bad ear infection when I was away you can kind of see a little bit now but honestly it's gone down a lot I got basically got some water trapped in my ear from the pool and I had to keep taking these like antibiotic eardrops and thankfully they worked but basically my face went so swollen here you can kind of see it in the clips from yesterday like when I've looked back at them it's a little bit swollen but nothing how it was anyway back to it you can see my lips today this is them with obviously lipstick on but to be honest the lipstick's kind of coming off because i've had it on all morning so i've got a little wipe here i'm going to wipe it off so you can properly see them because i want you guys to see the full results obviously the next day after having your lips done they do swell that is very normal they normally swell for like two to three days so they are a little bit swollen at the minute so they will go down this won't be the end result of them but honestly i absolutely love them i hope it kind of focuses please focus so this is my cupid's bow as you can see she's still kept the natural shape of my lips i always love this and i never really like them to touch it but basically she injected mainly on the sides of my lips just to kind of even it out because my lips weren't even to begin with so the shape of them now if you can see obviously it's quite close into my mouth hopefully i haven't got anything in my teeth um it just looks a lot more even and obviously they look a lot more plump like i said they do swell the second day so this is them swollen they were even more swollen when i woke up this morning so if you haven't had your lips done before and you are looking at getting them done or you've had them done and you like freak out the morning after it's very normal and also i'm coming on here and explaining what i have done because if you guys have been following me for a while on here you will know i did have no surgery back last year so i am very open about this kind of thing i don't have everything done like i'm not like crazy or getting surgery or like cosmetic things done i just would rather be open and honest with you guys because a lot of you actually do ask me over on my instagram if i've had my lips done and of course i'm going to be honest i do have them done but i haven't had my lips done now for so many i can't even remember the last time i had them done so they were definitely kind of overdue in my eyes that i wanted them to be topped up because obviously if you do have them you do have to keep maintaining it it doesn't last forever so i only had 0.5 mil so that is basically like half the injection and she puts the filler in so you can have as much as you want obviously it kind of depends on the person that's doing it but tanina she's just amazing at what she does i'll put her um handle here and also link down below because she is just the sweetest and she's even been featured on like this morning and loads of different articles because she is just so good at what she does so i couldn't recommend her enough if you are based in london or even if you're not and you want to travel to come see her i definitely recommend to get booked in because as you can see she's just an amazing job on my lips like i said they are a bit swollen today but they will go down and I just love how they look so even, yet it still keeps the natural shape of them with my cupid's bow. So yeah, I thought I would just cover them today and show you. Like I said, when I woke up this morning, they were a lot more swollen than they are now. So they have gone down a little bit. I'm just going to put loads of lip balm on them and just keep them moisturised. Also, FYI, I am in the same dress as I wore yesterday because I only had it on for a few hours. And I just love this dress. It's so easy to just kind of wear around the house on hot days like this. So I'll link it down below. I'm pretty sure I featured it in another vlog anyway. And I also have had a package come in. So I'm going to show you what I've got. It's a new package from Revolve. And it's got some really cute summer pieces. So this is the first dress. And it is very me with the puff sleeves. Love this like ruched detail in here. And this flower print is very on trend at the minute. And I just love the kind of like baby doll fit to it. How it comes out here. And then this is it at the back it just kind of comes down a little bit but it's such a nice fit and this is the size small i find with revolve the extra small can sometimes come very small so this actually fits really nice for the small and i'm usually a size eight for reference but yeah i feel like this is just such a cute dress to throw on put with some little sandals and you are good to go for summer also please ignore this lamp behind and all the mess here i still need to clean 
and sort the rest of the house it is underway but I'm going to show you the other pieces as well so next are these little shorts I've actually had my eye on these on the website for a while but these are an extra small so as you can see they are quite short and also at the back they're a little bit see-through as well I'd kind of wear these maybe like over a bikini or something more of like a beach look or just around the house I've just put it on with this shoulder pad tee that I've got from ASOS so I'll link this down below as well but I just like how they're so comfy and the material of them if you can see up close as well is so nice and it's got the elasticated waist here they're just really comfy easy to throw on so I've just like I said put it with this top but I'd kind of maybe put this over a bikini or something like that with a beach look or like a white linen shirt tied or like tucked in that kind of vibe going for but yeah as I said these are the extra small they do come quite short but they're just really nice to shove on maybe around the house as well also got this cute little top and it actually when it's come it's got this kind of like shiny finish to it but I love this flower pattern again very on trend and the fact it comes in here and then kind of puffs out but I need to show you the back of it probably not the most flattering angle at all hopefully it's focused in but it ties here at the back which is what kind of sold me on it but this is an extra small it fits absolutely fine I've just put it with some denim shorts to show you but I was thinking this would actually look so lush with some like white flared smart trousers or even some white jeans just to kind of contrast these colors but obviously I just wanted to quickly show you and this is the extra small it fits great and I just think this is a top that will just kind of never date and you can match it with so many different Lastly is this gorgeous swimsuit from LPA. I'm really gutted that this didn't come in time for my holiday but I love this back detail again how it kind of ties with this little hole similar to the top and also the flower pattern of pretty much every item in this little haul is flowers but I love the front of it as well it's got the cup detail in here and you just can't go wrong with a swimsuit but this is so gorgeous and hopefully take it on my next holiday which we are actually in the midst of planning so I'll share that with you guys soon but I'm pretty sure I got this in a size small because my other swimwear I found with Revolve comes very small and I kind of learnt my lesson not to order extra small anymore. So we're both just taking a little break from work. I feel like I've been non-stop today. What's he doing? Oh, he's got a wrapper of course. But I've just had these delivered, these ice creams. They're called New and oh my god it's so good. You've already had one haven't you? Yeah. He's he got snuck the it already. <laughs> And this is the salted caramel and macadamia nut and it is so good. I'm not usually a fan, like I don't really normally go for magnums, but gotta say, this is yummy. But we both just felt like we need a little break, we're walking baby. Just have a bit of a time out really. So we are due to do our food shop because we haven't done it since we've got back. Hence why our fridge is ridiculously empty. But I've been sent these goo desserts. I've never actually tried goo before. These are the cheesecake ones. This is salted caramel. Oh my God, it looks insane. And then this one is chocolate and vanilla. So I'm gonna try these out for pudding tonight. We're just about to go do our food shop. So that will be a pudding. And then I've also been sent some more goodies. I mean, I need to get on my diet after holiday, after all the food I've eaten from New. And they're these ice creams. We've already had one. As you can see, it's already open. I had the salted caramel and Chris had this one. It was the coconut, if it focuses, coconut and Indian mango. I'm not normally a coconut fan, but he said it was amazing. But these, honestly, were so good. I'm not really normally a Magnum fan or like chocolate ice cream, but gotta say these are so good and this is the other flavor that I got sent which is the dark chocolate and berry so I definitely will try that out as well but I thought I'd share them with you because what a good day to be sent these amazing yummy goodies so kind of stocked up oh god stocked up on them but now we need to go get all the healthy food from the shop should we go to pub we're gonna go to pub huh we're gonna go to pub yeah so we've decided to not do our food shop again and we're going to go to the pub instead because it's getting late now and we want some grub but hopefully they do like a good salad or something there to try and be healthy. Bailey. You're going to come to the pub with us? Should we go to the pub? Should we go to the pub? Oh. He's so beautiful. Tilt your head if you want to go pub. To the pub. Pub. He's handsome. Bailey Paul. Good oh, boy. he's a good boy. You can have the wrapper. I'm having to bend down because the camera is so low and I haven't brought my 
tripod upstairs but we just got back from the pub we had a little impromptu date night i'm literally wearing my oldest pjs i must have had these for like i don't even know like three years or something they're really old from nasty girl but i just love them you know they're just like your comfies but i'm just about to do my skincare i'm going to come down here well i'm literally lower than the sink right now quickly put my hair back honestly i feel like this must be like Probably like the favourite time of my day where I just take off my makeup, get my PJs. So I'll quickly show you what I'm using. I'm going to go in with the Elemis cleansing balm. I normally use the rose one, but I've been using this one recently, which is the Neroli one. It smells a dream. As you can see, I've already used a lot of it. So this is to take my makeup off. And obviously I always double cleanse and I go in with my Foreo cleanser and the soy facial cleaner i love this stuff and then as you saw from my unboxing i recently got some top ups from elemis so i'm using the overnight radiance peel that really helps with my pigmentation and then my favorite night cream which is the elemis plumping pillow facial this honestly is my favorite it is so good and your skin just wakes up in the morning like it says on the bottle, plumped. So I'm going to start with the Elemis cleansing balm and go from there. But it's so hard because the camera is so low right now. I'm trying to bend down and get in focus. I need to get on my tripod, really. Oh, this is so good. And it's honestly smells amazing. It just melts away your makeup. As you can see already, look, it's all coming off. Don't take it personal, I ain't lying. I ain't hiding, I've been grinding, multiplying. I've been trying to get my weight up. Staying prayed up, meditating and taking time away You always posting up pictures, trying to look like you winning I'm writing rhymes in the kitchen, soaking in moments we live in, yeah You got the nerve to be on me, faking your life for the IG If you got my number, don't add me, cause baby 